This is Danielle Sanders, Managing Editor of the Chicago Defender. I am here with our publisher, Ms. Diana Knight-Lewis, to talk about the Chicago Defender's Men and Women of Excellence. Can you tell everybody what what is the significance of Men and Women of Excellence? Well, um, you know, the Chicago Defender, for as many years as we've been around, which is almost 117 years now, we have been celebrating the African-American community. We've been celebrating um, African-Americans and their achievements. And so it just only made sense for us to begin um, 15 years ago with men and women of excellence. And I believe it was women of excellence that began first in March of 2007. So the inaugural Women of Excellence Induction and Award Ceremony was originally held during Women's History Month on March 30th, 2007 and continues annually for now the 15th year. It, it used to be known as the Chicago Defenders 50 Women of Excellence because each year we celebrate 50 African American women who inspire others through their vision and leadership, exceptional achievements and participation in community service and for their success as business leaders, community activists, philanthropists, and entrepreneurs, the Chicago Defenders readership, along with past honorees, nominate for this distinction. They are chosen from hundreds of nominees and will be joining the ranks of Chicagoland's most influential women. So far to date, uh, the Distinguished Award has been presented to 700 of Chicago's brightest and most accomplished women. The Chicago Defender has celebrated the courage, resilience, determination, expertise, achievement, and dedication of these women, including Carol Mosley Braun, former senator and ambassador, Margaret Garner, the first African-American woman of contracted to build a Walmart, Emma Mitz, alderman of the 37th Ward, who had a vision for a better life for her West Side constituents, Peggy Sutton of Mayfair Academy, where I attended dance, who has provided cultural dance education and instruction on the South Side of Chicago for over 50 years, the late, great Mary D, legendary media maven, uh, may God rest her soul, and Michelle Obama, for her contributions in healthcare and medicine at the University of Chicago. For me, this program is one I look forward to every year. It is an honor and a pleasure to be part of, of this since its inception because without a doubt, it's the best part of what I do. And I am grateful, so grateful for the opportunity. Yeah. It's a great way for us to continue the legacy of the Chicago Defender in amplifying our people and amplifying the good that's happening in our communities and really changing the narrative. Having people like Alden and Stephanie Coleman from, from Inglewood, we're changing the narrative of what mainstream America and media looks at when they think about black people and black excellence. So it's really about continuing the tradition of the Chicago Defender. Absolutely. And to date, we have honored over 1,400 men and women of excellence, and so it continues. It continues, and we're on our 15th year, our 15th anniversary of Men and Women of Excellence. And once again, as soon as we send those letters out to each and every individual that has been selected, we look forward to the excitement, to the enthusiasm, and to spotlighting and featuring them.